Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Um, today is Sunday, June 4th and it's a pretty exciting day for me today because I am going to be going out to South Coast Plaza because I'm going to be picking up my Louis Vuitton, the Speedy 30 and I had all the Vaquetta changed on it and uh, they said it was going to take six weeks but it's actually only taken three. So I'm going to be showing you my outfit of the day that I have on and the first thing that you can see is this necklace right here in the statement necklace and I purchased this from Cozy and Chic which is Christy J's online boutique so I thought this would really look pretty against this uh, dress that I have on and these earrings right here I picked them up from um, from Avon and I have these uh, little bracelets right here this is like little um, little beads and um, I also I got this also from Avon and I just have on my rings and this right here is my Henry Bendel ring and um, let me show you the shoes that I will have on because you probably won't be able to see them when I'm standing back and uh, there are these cute little um, sandals right here and it has this little flowery detail right there so that's what they look like and let me show you the um, glasses that I'm going to be putting on and also the bag. So I'm going to have on my coach sunglasses right here. I tell you, I just love these glasses. I love the color of them. And I'm going to be using my, um, my Damier Azure, um, what is it? Pochette accessoire. So I'm going to stand back so you guys can see everything I have on. And the, the dress that I have on, I also purchased from Avon as well. So I'm going to step back. Okay, so I will be doing a little bit of vlogging um, when I'm out at the mall. I also have to stop into Henry Bendo because I had picked up, I had ordered a few little goodies, so I'm going to be picking them up from there. So, um, yeah, so I'm going to be doing a little bit of vlogging, so that will um, be following um, after, uh, after this right here. Okay, so bye-bye everyone. Take care.
too. Wow. Oh, okay. Oh, so they were able to put the because uh, before they were saying they didn't know if they were gonna be if they were gonna put the new chaps on or but I see that they were able to keep the original older ones. Nice. Okay. Hello everyone. So today I am going to be finally showing you guys the bag with the brand new Vaquetta on it. But first I kind of wanted to, um, to, to talk to you about my experience, okay? So I went into Louis Vuitton and I told them I wanted all the Vaquetta changed out and I asked them how much it was going to be. And so the young lady that I was dealing with, she told me that it was going to be about $585, something like that, plus tax. So I said, okay, fine. So I left the bag. And she said it was going to take about six weeks. I says, okay. So then I got a call three weeks later saying that the bag was ready. And I was like, oh, wow, that was, that was really fast, you know. So for some unknown reason, I said to myself, I hope they change the zipper pull. Now, I don't know why that came into my mind, but it did. Now, it just came in and left, okay? I didn't dwell on it or anything like that, so that was that. So then I went in to pick up the bag, and, you know, he was showing me the bag, and then um, I said, he was, he was folding the bag back up, and he was getting ready to put it back in the dust bag, and I said, wait a minute. So I looked, and sure enough, they didn't change the zipper pull. And I thought to myself, why would they not change the zipper pull? So I said to him, they didn't change the zipper pull. So he said, um, well, that's not, that's separate, that's not part of it. And I says, you know, I don't understand what you, what you mean. I said, you know, my instructions were, I want all the vaquetta changed out. That's on the outside. So he goes, okay, well, wait a minute. So he left and he came back and he goes, yeah, you know, that's not part of it. That's not included. I says, well, how am I to know this? I says, you know, that's something that you guys need to let me know. So he goes, well, you know, we didn't know either. And I thought, what? You know, I'm like, am I the first person that has ever come in here to get the vaquetta changed out that they didn't know that the zipper pull wasn't included? And it, it, it just didn't make sense to me what he was saying. So I said, you know, well, I don't know this information. So I said, you know, why would I want all the vaquetta changed and leave the zipper pull? I said, that's just, that just doesn't make sense. And he goes, well, you know, that's why they tried to match the vaquetta up, you know, the new vaquetta. I said, but it doesn't match, you know. So, um, you know, to me, I thought, why couldn't it, why couldn't he just say, you know what, we messed up, sorry, we'll correct it. Instead of coming up with all these excuses as to why it wasn't done, because none of it made any sense. And so then he said to me, well, okay, you know, we'll, you know, we can, we'll change it out in store and, you know, it'll be complimentary. So I'm like, complimentary? I just gave you guys $581. Now, when I went to pick it up, it only cost $540 not the 585 so i don't know i'm thinking that you know because they didn't change the zipper pull out it reduced the price down to 540 plus with tax it came to 581 something like that i have the receipt so he said you know okay he said well can you leave the bag for another week so i said okay fine you know he goes you know we'll you know change it out in store you know in, in the store and so i said okay that's fine and, um, you know, so anyway, this video is long enough. So without further ado, I know you guys want to see the bag. So it came in this dust bag, which is pretty big. And um, let me get it out for you. So here, let me open it up here. Then so I can open it all up. 
so here she is right here so um, she has uh, I had all the piping done I had this right here done I mean I had all the baquetta done here are the handles the chaps and the zipper pull that they were supposed to change in the beginning and then this tab right here now they gave me the a whole brand new zipper of course so you can see how shiny that is right there so um and what else um now when i first took it in to have it done the young lady didn't know if they would have the um the older pot the original pots chaps to put on there she thought that they might put the new ones on there but i'm really glad that they did have the older ones on there to keep the bag in its original um you know shape with the original you know stuff that's on it and this bag right here was i forget when it was done let's see here okay it was um this bag was produced in 1990. So this bag is 27 years old and she looks absolutely beautiful, especially now with all her brand new vaquetta on it and everything. So, um, yeah, let me see. Oh, and I also got a little something for her. And let me show you guys what I got. Nothing spectacular, nothing special, anything like that. Just a little something something. But I picked up this luggage tag right here. So uh, I always kind of wanted a luggage tag, but you know, because you know the vaquetta on it was you know darker, not really dark, but it was darker. Then I didn't want to get a, a new, um, a new uh, brand new vaquetta. Uh, uh, blah, 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 I can't even talk here. I didn't want to get a uh, a luggage tag up again. I didn't think I would like how it would look up against the. Uh, you know the dock of the Keta. but now I don't know if you can notice but this right here is lighter than this okay so I asked the young lady I says how come this how come this isn't brighter so she said to me she says well these are spare pots and you know they have them sitting around and so because of that they do end up getting a little you know a little darker i mean it's not dark but it's darker than this right here um and she said you know what they try to do is they try to match up all the pieces you know to so therefore all the vaquetta that they put on the bag will match but yeah that's the reason why this is a little bit lighter than this is because these like I said are spare pots so they're so they're sitting around it's not like you know getting a whole brand new bag okay so that's what it will look like on and um, this right here just cost me $60 I didn't get it hot stamped yet because I haven't decided what I want um, to put on it I really don't think I want my initials um, so I don't I don't know yet exactly what I want but this right here is her and there was something else I wanted to tell you guys too but I just can't remember so let's see here um, where is it cost where's the receipt at here's the receipt right here and it cost $540, plus it was $41.85 in tax, so it cost $581.85. Now, you know, I had purchases, oh, I know what I wanted to tell you guys. I will show you pictures of what the Vaquetta looked like beforehand. And, um, and you know, and you can, you know, already know what it looks like now. But the reason why I got it changed, the vaquetta on it wasn't dark, but I had purchased it pre-loved. And when I got it, you know, the handles, you know, I don't know, they had cleaned it with something, but it just, it just had a funny, a funny, uh, feeling to it. It wasn't, it was a little dry, but it just, it just wasn't right okay and I had had the bag for about four years and you know I decided you know what I'm gonna go ahead and get all the vaquetta changed out and um, you know and just you know give her a little bit more life to her 
And um, so, yeah, so that's what I did. And now I'm afraid to use her because um, for me, this is my first time actually having brand new Vaquetta because all of my bags um, are pre-loved, all my monogram bags are pre-loved. And so therefore the Vaquetta is already patinaed. So this one right here is the first time I, you know, will have a bag that um, I will actually have the opportunity to patina myself. And I'm really excited about that. I'm excited and I'm nervous all at the same time. And um, I, I don't know if I'm going to treat the leather or not. Um, let me see. Uh, I'm not a fellow YouTuber... LV Coffee Lover, uh, her patina on her bags are beautiful and she doesn't do anything to it. And so I was kind of leaning towards that way of just, just letting it naturally take its course. Um, here in California, it doesn't rain really much, so I don't have to worry about water spots really or anything like that as far as the rain getting, you know, being caught out in the rain. But um, yeah, so I think I'm just, I just may leave her alone, okay? And just use her like she is and not treat the leather or anything like that. But um, anyway, I know this video is super long, but um, here she is in all her glory. And I am really, really excited to um, have, you know, had the patina changed on it. I mean, the vaquetta changed on it. And looking forward to now using her and, um, and watching her, watching the patina uh, like I said, I can't talk watching the Vaquetta patina. So anyway, today is July 3rd, the day before July 4th. And um, this video may get up a little bit after that. And so, but anyway, I just want to say have a wonderful and uh, safe holiday. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye-bye.